Hey everybody, my name is Mike Montgomery and today we're going to build this three-tiered metal and wood bookcase. This is a super simple welding project and if you're interested and have never welded before, this might be the perfect place to start. And really quick, you don't have to weld this. In fact, I've made a no weld metal and wood coffee table as well as a no weld metal and wood dining table and I'll put links to those in the description. You can use the exact same techniques I did to get a perfectly strong bookshelf. So now let's get started on Modern Builds. <laughs> I'll be building the frame out of 1 inch by 1 inch steel tubing and it has an 8 inch thick wall. After I used acetone to clean off all of the steel, I measured and cut it to length. Now I will have a link in the description to the written article that has not only SketchUp files for this project, but all of the cut lists and materials and supplies you'll need to build this yourself. With my pieces cut to length, I could mark the locations for all of my shelf supports. Then, I laid them out on the concrete making sure everything was square, and I used these really cool right angle magnets to help keep everything in place while I tack welded everything. Welding really is a lot simpler than it seems, and it's a lot more affordable than you might expect too. In fact, I made a video titled Intro to Welding for Woodworkers. The idea was to make a video to help tear down any of those barriers that might have kept you from welding before. So we go over different machines, different types of welding, along with the common materials that you'll use if you're building frames and table bases like this. And that video will be linked below. And as you can see, I'm using a flux core MIG welder, and I'm trying to make small cursive E's as I make my bead. It's a way to help get better contact between your two pieces of metal. You want to keep making that pattern and as you go, try and maintain about a 3 quarter inch lead between the end of your gun and the piece of metal you're working with. Now my welds weren't pretty and yours probably won't be too for a while, so you're going to want to get a grinding disc on an angle grinder and smooth out all of those welds. Welding is just one of those things that the more you practice, the better you get. But what's awesome is it doesn't matter how ugly your weld looks, you can always grind and sand it down. As long as it holds the metal together, then you're on the right path. With the frame done, it was time to move to the shelves, which are made from wood. The top shelf is built out of a single 2x10 that I cut to length and then ripped to size on my table saw. I glued the two halves together to make the full width of the shelf, and then once it was dry, I could sand everything down and test the fit and cut it to length. I wanted the bottom two shelves to be a little bit lighter, so I used a 1x10 rather than a 2x. And unlike the top shelf, the bottom two needed to fit around the legs of the frame, so I used a scrap piece of steel to mark them out and I cut them out with a jigsaw. What was really cool about these shelves is that they fit really snug in the frame, so I didn't even need to use any screws to hold them down. On my no weld coffee table I used these little wooden pegs as feet for the table and I wanted to do the same thing for this shelf. It's a really cool look and it's a great way to level out your piece in case everything wasn't perfect. So thanks for watching, I really appreciate it. Let me know how you guys like these metal projects, welding or not. I'm gonna put a card in the corner of the screen. I can never remember what side it's on. And it's just a survey asking if you're into metalworking, and if so, do you like welding? Or do you like the no weld metal projects better? Of course, if you just hate the metalworking in general, please let me know, because I wanna build stuff that you guys are interested in. Also, if you are interested in welding, make sure and check out that video, Intro to Welding for Woodworkers. It's on my second channel, Mike from Modern Builds. It's about 15 minutes long, but it tells you everything you need to know to kind of get comfortable with the equipment, 
the technique, as well as the metal and project materials that you'll be using. Getting started welding is really simple and surprisingly affordable. Of course, you're not gonna have pretty welds when you start, just like me, but if you're fine grinding down all of those welds to make things smooth, you're gonna get a perfectly fine project. Links for that, along with the written article for this project, will be in the description. Make sure and go to the written article, get the plans, get the SketchUp file if you wanna edit it, and have some fun with it. Thanks everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and until next time, this has been Modern Builds. Bye, everybody. Oh, wait. Um, subscribe right here, and then there'll be a couple videos right here. Man, I am forgetting everything today. See ya.